you know, and, and for those reasons, I'm not smiling about what Devin is being sent in there to go do. They're being serious about the bet, you know, it's 500,000 per pound. It was, you know, just, it was just a regular bet, then it became 500,000 per pound. Are being serious about it? That's just a formality. I'm sending Devin in there to go kill him, literally. Bill, the Water Ward Media Group. What do you make of Ryan's antics? Is it just a sell to no, fight? I just or do told you think it's you. Listen, some seriously the wrong? antics and all. Well, listen, I'm saying this. The, the, I gave him the book, The Psych Psychology of Dummies, because that's what he thinks that we are. He thinks that all of you guys are dummies, and he's playing this 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 art of war, this mind game. Mm -hmm. But but the way that he's violated, um, Devin will demonstrate on April the 20th, and that there's nothing. Um, um, laugh, laugh, or play, play about, about what Devin is going to go do to him in that center of the ring. Period. You said that Devin. You said that uh, Devin is saying that Ryan hasn't gotten much better since the amateurs. Why do you guys feel that way? I mean, whatever Ryan is going to come and go do, Devin does better. Devin going to beat him at his own game. He said he wants to. He wants to fight, and he wants to fight in front of the people. A fight that the New York people deserve because you don't come here playing. And um, that's just what he's going to do. He's going to go beat, it, beat his ass on April the 20th in Brooklyn in front of everybody. Bill, you got a new name on social media. If he dies, he dies, Bill. How hey, do we, listen. How do, we, how do we change the narrative of Eddie, you talk Devin Haney, you know, stepping on the gas and punishing fighters on Saturday? Um, well, I mean, you, all you got to do is do all the, the antics and all the disrespect that he's done, and that's what's going to happen to the next opponent, any opponent after. Um, this is what we sta we have a standard, and uh, of what we going to accept and what we going to go for. And Ryan has stepped over the uh, he stepped over the line on numerous times, and and this is what it is. It's going to be a legal homicide uh, for all that suicide shit that he didn't did. Bill, do you feel like this is uh, April twentieth is a manifestation of your vision? You know, when you first uh, knew that Devin Haney would. Uh, uh, when Derek Harmon told you that he was a natural, oh, oh, you feel like natural. this is uh, basically like well, a... Well, I always say boxing and, and boxing found Devin, and it was a marriage um, like a cowboy finding his first horse. And they've been riding, um, you know, happy uh, ever since then. We have, a, we have one goal in mind, and that's to be the best to ever put on a pair of gloves, period. Um, I always say what's better than the best fighter ever. Bill, can you talk about the, the inspiration? No, I said what's better than the best fighter ever. Devin the Dream Haney. Bill Eddie, can you talk about the inspiration of, uh, you know, you came yes. out kind of like Don King. That's that's what I thought of immediately. Uh, is that who inspired you? I mean, you, you know, Don, Don, King, Don King is a, a respectable uh, black uh, a hero and icon in the community. If, if someone says that I resemble him, well, they, they only saying that I'm, I resemble a man that uh, with his chin up, he, hand held, head held high, representing the culture and represent what he stood on. And, and that's what I do. I represent the culture. I represent what Devin stands on, our business practices, our ethics, our morals, and, and, and that's what this is. Bill, Eddie said some great words up there. He said Devin Haney is the future of the sport. Just get reactions to Eddie's great words about the sun. Oh, absolutely. Daddy, uh, Eddie. Uh, believed early on uh, when we when we decided to do the deal with him, and, and he, you guys are seeing uh, a manifestation of a lot of hard work, a lot of dedication and discipline to be the face of the sport, meaning crossing platforms to make the fights happen. That means, you know, being accessible, um, you know what I mean, and being transparent, and that's what being the face of boxing is. Bill, how much of an influence and help has Ben Davidson been in this camp as well? Obviously, he can't come here, but just talk to me about Ben and Lee while he's uh Help in this camp oh, Ben, Ben and Lee Wyatt have all, Lee are, have always been inspirational and motivational because they they have a, another eye. You know what I mean? That's our that's our secret weapon over there in the UK. Uh, they're always looking and, and observing. Even if we're not able to get hands on, we communicate back and forth. You know through uh, WhatsApp and um, you know Instagram and stuff like that. So shout out to Ben and Lee for doing an amazing job over there with Joshua. Eddie, Eddie's just predicted a uh, eight to ten round stoppage so today. Are you going earlier? I told you, a stoppage just won't be good enough for us. We want him to go to the hospital. We want him fucked up, you know what I mean? We want him beat up, you know what I mean? You know, close to death, you know what I mean? And I said, listen, this is on the zone, and, and it, this is an 18 and over fight right here. You know, kids shouldn't watch this unless they're with their parents and they're, and they're explained to it responsibly and appropriately. Other than that, you're looking at a match and you're looking at a man that's being sent in to kill another man. That's what Devin Haney is being sent in to do to Ryan Garcia. What's the thing that's upset you the most? Is it the religion aspect about Ryan? I mean, when you upset, you upset. You never look about why I got upset. How did I get here? It's not about how I got here. It's about me feeling good. And I won't feel good until Ryan Garcia is punished.
out of all the other fights you've had, uh, Devin Haney, uh, come Saturday night once he... I can't think about nothing but uh, uh, April the 20th. They can't yeah, come yeah, fast enough. Go to it, once, <laughs> it was, the words wasn't strong when they was coming at us. I don't want to hear nothing about nothing being strong. He going to get it. He's going to get it and he's going to be the example of when you fuck with the Haney's, what happens. Let's go. Hey, hey, hey,